Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Answers with me, Charmaine. I'm here today with Andrew Jarvis. He is the writer, producer, and director. He also plays AJ in The World According to AJ. Back to when you first started thinking about making this production, do you think it would, do you think it's come as, do you think you would have come as far as you have? I don't know how I worded that on the question, but you would remember. I don't think I would have made it this far without the support of David, Kaylee, or Charmaine, yourself. <laughs> you can't put that in there and make me cry in my pregnant state. <laughs> oh, bless you, you're so sweet. Ages did I think I'd make it. I tried dressing it off the ground myself, but with the help of my friends and a brilliant crew, it's now become a production that everyone wants, that I know wants to see, succeed. That's and I'm eternally grateful for that. That's brilliant that you have the support that you need. The scenes, do you have a vision of how the scenes are going to look or is it an ongoing process? With the first script, I had a decent plot line that I knew I was going to write. And that folded into the second one. But address as again, addressing the crew and the cast, they switched around so the second one has now become the first script. So the scenes themselves have in a way become visualised through the efforts of my casting crew. How did you go about selecting actors and actresses to play the characters? I think it was finding someone who could visualise the characters in their head and get a decent hold on them, on the personalities. What makes your character relatable to the audience? Hopefully he, he'll make people laugh. That's essential. Do you find it a little, a little daunting to play yourself on screen? Yes and no. I think that bringing my sense of humour is essential, as I said. But also there are flaws that you can extract to the people. If your life had a theme tune, what would it be? A theme tune. I'd say Everyday Superhero by Smash Mouth. 